Hi, this is Mike from the Military Traveler, and we just landed in Guanaja, Honduras. It's a small island off the mainland of Honduras. We then took about a 10 to 15 minute boat ride across from the airport over to the villas on Dunbar Rock. And here are the villas, and I will be spending about a week here, and we'll be showing you just what the facilities look like and how nice the villa is. You can see that there's stairways up to the rooms. There's also a ramp going all the way around Dunbar Rock and up to the top where the main facilities are. As you walk up from the boat ramp to the first floor, you find the presidential suite and that's pretty much the only thing that is on the first floor. It's really just a half floor by itself. It comes with a refrigerator that is fully stocked with uh, whatever beverages you would like to have. And it has a nice little sitting area, area for making your coffee, whatever you might want, anything you want in this hotel you, or in this re villa, you pretty much can get it. Nice bathroom, nice shower, everything that you need, like I said, is here. You have plenty of storage another sitting area, king size bed, the only room in the villa that has a TV, um, more storage area, and my favorite thing, you walk outside to the hot tub with a really nice view on your porch and your own little entrance up to the second floor and directly to the bar. Inside the main floor you're gonna find pool table, area to relax, have a drink. Inside the office there's a gift shop. Then we have the bar area and also where we normally have breakfast and lunch. You can see the folks hard at work. Also the swimming pool that I mentioned earlier. Nice infinity pool going out towards the Caribbean. Down here on the second floor or basically the main floor is where most of the activity occurs. Uh, down here are still uh, some of the queen rooms and a king size room also the courtyard that I'm in right now uh, entrance over to the reception area the dining area the bar the swimming pool etc and of course you have to say hello to Gina and Coco Gina has the red Coco is a little bit shy they'll, they'll whistle at you all day this is one of the standard king size rooms at Villa on Dunbar Rock can see that it's spacious, has a nice comfortable bathroom with shower, and then you can go on out to the patio. And the small patio that you have out here overlooks the water towards the town of Banaka, overlooking the boat ramp. Now I'm up on the fourth floor. This is the penthouse. We'll go inside. Starts out with a large living area where here's a picnic table for you to use in case you want to like entertain. You have plenty of space in here in the living room. Kind of a little dinette type thing. Once again, there's a stocked, fully stocked refrigerator for you. A TV in the penthouse also. Then the penthouse has two queen size beds as opposed to having a king size bed but it's a very large area and then over here you have a large walkway into the bathroom a shower and then a very large bathroom that you can use here very large storage area also for your closet you can go in here and have everywhere that you need to hang up your items there's, like I said, outside, large balcony, uh, several swings, etc. So the penthouse definitely has plenty of room if you need it. I'm now up on the top floor, which houses the penthouse suite, which also has up here two or three patios with swings. Over here is the fitness center. More of the swings that I was just mentioning. From up here, you have a 360 degree view of the water, the island, and just everything down here 
is just very nice looking. We're going to go down to the third floor and show you a little bit more down around there. The third floor houses several of the queen and king size rooms. Also has this large balcony, large deck. Um, like I said, several of the floors and some of these floors have very large patios that they can utilize and it overlooks the swimming pool which is an infinity pool and we'll see it again later down on the second floor.